This is the amount of silicone grease that comes in the X-Max stock. Obviously, that is not enough. Uh, I've, as you see, there instead of pins, there are actually big blocks of metal up against the plastic casing. As soon as they come out with metal casings, I will be right on top of those because a vehicle of this size, this is the X Max, a vehicle of this size, plastic in the drive line just is not going to cut it. As soon as uh hubs and c-knuckles come out i'll be buying those but basically what you're going to want to do is take your lube this is 50,000 weight uh plenty thin enough for such a big vehicle and you're just going to want to fill it up get every little nook and cranny So there's plenty of lubrication in there. You don't want anything breaking. And then after I get that done. And I get the spur gear part put back on. I completely coat all the gears completely inside. I've already wiped the uh, stock grease out. I take marine grease. Uh, the good stuff about this is it has silicone in it, so it's waterproof. Uh, and it's also a very good grease for if you're wanting to waterproof something. These are already waterproof. Whoops. <laughs> I accidentally held it sideways and had some silicone oil come out I have to refill it a little but just completely coat all the gear teeth with some marine grease put it back in place five bolts hold the five bolts hold the cover back in place and then you reinstall skid plate reinstall bumper and you're done Again, I love how they designed this truck. Very easy to work on.